Uh, Winifred West, who was a founder of Frensham, believed strongly in the natural environment. She felt that in order for children to be educated properly, they needed to be part of, immersed in, and understand the natural beauty of the environment they live in. French is part of what's called uh, the Land for Wildlife Group. We have over 100 acres of natural bushland, this area here called the Upper Holt, and that's connected via the Nadi Creek down into this area which we call the Lower Holt. We're really keen to work with the local environmental groups to establish and maintain a native corridor that allows animals to move from the Gibbagunya Reserve up here, down through Frencham, down through the Nadi, and then down eventually into the Nadi National Park. The, the environmental program at Frencham is called Halting because this area is the lower halt. The initial part of the program was removing invasive species and replacing those with natives especially along the creek line of the Nadai Creek um, to restore it back because in the past the area had been grazed by cattle. Over the years we've probably planted several thousand um, grasses and native trees so things like lamandras and wattles and native eucalypts that are, are suitable to this area. The people at the, the Waripendi Nursery have been terrific in providing us with um, the appropriate vegetation for this area. Our aim over the, the next little while is to maintain and extend the wildlife corridor between Mount Alexandra and Mount Gibraltar coming through the lower halt along the Natai Creek. Most recent times we've been very lucky to be involved with uh, a local environmentalist who's very keen on supporting wildlife on the Frencham grounds and the girls have been involved in the rehabilitation of wombats as an example, but also other native parrots, birds and possums. All the latest educational research will tell you that children learn best when they're immersed in authentic learning activity. So we strongly believe that girls playing a hands-on role in looking after animals and looking after plants is really important for their learning. We're building drays which are nests for ringtail possums. These drays are for when they ringtail possums fall out of their trees during storms and they can't get back up until when the storms pass so they'll just rest in here while the storms continue. Um, we're cementing in some posts for wildlife monitoring huts so um, there'll be a camera set up on top of this when we get some tin on it to watch the burrows and monitor them, so yeah. So this flat that we've made is going to prevent the wombats from getting mange and stop it. So this lid will have sidectum in it, which is a um, like a liquid, and it's as the wombat goes through from the burrow, the sidectum will fall and hit the wombat on its back and will stop the mange disease, which is a slow disease that um, is killing the wombats. <laughs> I like helping the wombats and the possums and making like homes for them and stuff. Yeah, it's really interesting to see what you find that you didn't know there was there before and it's really fun to explore around in the bush and yeah we found some burrows when we were walking and they were really close to the path and some were in trees some were like really hidden so you had to kind of go through the bush to find them and some were um like right next to each other around yeah, yeah we're making nice homes for them and they've got places to go where they need and they've got shelter if there's like predators around. I feel wombats have a right to, you know, um, live like in this world because they're part of the ecosystem and they deserve to be here. If we like keep developing the halt and making sure it really, you know, caters for them here, I think they'll <laughs> be comfortable. Yeah. To, on the fences, towards the roads and um, on the boundaries we've put some metal posts in between the fence um, poles um, just to stop the foxes from 
coming and disturbing the um, the nature of the wombats. Since we've just I've started halting, I've really developed a love for wombats and really discovered how they're just really cute, cuddly, friendly animals and I think they have some people have developed quite a bad reputation for them but I just really understand now that it's not true and you know they just seem really happy here at Frenchman which makes me happy as well.